Hey everybody, Kyla T here. Um, this video actually is of a piece that I worked on earlier. This was actually the last piece that I did before my computer died, and I swear to God, it's cursed. So, um, this is actually a piece of fan art done for the character Jack Klein in the latest season of Supernatural, which is actually really good, and I might go on to talk about that after this, but the actor is Alexander Calver, who you might know. I think he was an Arrow. I don't know. I don't watch Arrow. Um, but I think he was in that, and then he ended up playing Jack on Supernatural, but I really like his character, Jack. Um, a very... Like, I, I love his whole arc, and I really love what they've been doing with his character this season. I feel like there's actual progression, which, um, if you know me, I'm very critical about supernatural and character progression. Because, to me, and I've kind of started viewing the show like this, and it kind of helps a bit. I almost view it now as a long ongoing comic series and like each one has its different run but there's also different writers in between you know who you could tell their style differentiating from di everybody else's um most notably Robbie Thompson who was one of my favorite ongoing writers at the time when I when the show was going on who unfortunately he like he left um around season uh not tw i think it was 12 season not season 12 uh season 11 um and i actually ended up meeting him at c2e2 last weekend which is uh the chicago comics and entertainment expo he was sitting at a booth answering questions and he was so nice uh very engaging with the fans told me he missed the show a lot and he's still in good contact with everybody but yeah he's a really cool guy um but anyway let me go back to this nightmare of a picture so the thing is is that i you know this file was stuck on my old computer and i managed to get it off and i was recording you know what i had left so the first recording i did went through but the second was always corrupted and no matter what I did, I tried to change the file, I tried to do this, I tried to do that, nothing was working. So eventually I had, but like I could play the file back. I could literally, like it would open and everything, it's just every time I tried to put it in a video editing software, it wouldn't work. So I literally had to go and like let this play on another screen recording software <laughs> and pretty much watch my record my recording again and even then that didn't work so this has been such a pain in the ass alex's face or jack's character one or the other they're cursed they're they're fucking cursed uh, it's just it's such a ah oh, it was so horrible but um yeah so Anyway, I guess I'll talk real quick about Supernatural and everything because, um, and you'll see more fan art from the sh about the show and from the show, like on on here on this channel because I am a fan. Uh, the show is now geared up for 14th season. The sucker won't die. <laughs> like it still, it won't die. Um, and to be honest, I kind of want it to end, if only because I know that the guys, mostly because I know the guys really want a break, especially Jensen and Jared, because they are uh, still brand new fathers, and I think they want that break so they could go uh, be, you know, be dads. But the problem in television is that you can't really do that. So, like, if you t you can't take a hiatus or a break like that especially on a show like supernatural you would have to pause the whole of production but then that would cause issues for the network like what are we going to stick in there and all this other stuff blah 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 which is why i honestly feel that if if something happened supernatural got moved to maybe netflix or something you know then that could work out better because i think people would be more forgiving about a hiatus or a show on pause with netflix since it's such an unconventional netflix doesn't have to uh go on conventional standards of television no you know like it doesn't like shows don't have to be 30 minutes or like 
45 minutes you know shows could be an hour and a half long and only have like maybe four episodes a season or something like that you know like that they, they could take breaks in between for two years you know they they aren't um as strict to a schedule like um you know the cw is on regular television um but and I guess that's another real quick thing I'll bring up is that I am kind of glad that the show went on this long if only because if like we are in such a revival period of the 90s now like the 80s nostalgia tapped out so now we're going into the 90s and I lived through the 90s I was born in 93 so I caught that that nice middle section and tail end of the 90s um it, it was okay the 90s was not the best like but it was okay um and like we're bringing back so many like late 90s early 2000s tv shows now like superman is getting another tv show except this time it's about his planet and not high school which funny enough jensen ackles was also on if you ever watched smallville um and like they're bringing back charmed we brought back Queer Eye for the, for the straight guys, what it was called before. Before it was just called Queer Eye. Like, we're bringing all this shit back. So it's like, even if Supernatural ended where it was supposed to end, it would have just got brought back. And given how Jared and Jensen are not that old, like, fuck, Gilmore Girls came back and Jared had a cameo in that. So it's like, given the fact they aren't that old, they probably would have come back for the revival so literally we would be exactly where we are now except maybe starting at season six so <laughs> i'm just like i don't really mind now that that it's lasted this long considering now that we have the power of hindsight and we can kind of see how this would have progressed you know it's like just leave it there you know it it was gonna come back anyway um but yeah, uh, so far this season, um, I really liked the way everything's been going considering how much I've fucking hated season 12. I'm actually kind of shocked. Like season 12 only had a couple of good episodes, but the plot overall was such a fucking mess. I stopped watching midway through and I only tune in for the finale which made me even more mad. And I was only watching the premiere of season 13 out of spite, to be honest, because I was like, how the fuck are you going to, like, what's going to happen to the, like, here? Like, what, what could you possibly do? And then they did, they proved me wrong. And so far, I've been going strong. Um, I only have a few episodes with complaints, but that's because of a writing duo that I do not like, and I've started to boycott their episodes. Um, there's an episode coming on tonight that I wish I could boycott, but for reasons I cannot, because, damn it, uh, this is like closer to the end of, of this the 13th season, and if you guys, if if you know why, if you know why, then you can understand like my conf my conflicting emotions on this. I'm just god damn it, um. But yeah, so I think I rambled on long enough. Uh, I guess I'll give my closing uh, words, I guess, about this piece. So uh, this piece, I wanted to leave it black and white, kind of ink-like, almost um, in reference to the old text and like drawings and stuff that you would find on like old tomes in Supernatural. Uh, especially like if Sam's doing research and he's flipping around and you see like old drawings and stuff. It mostly looks like old ink line art and that's what I was trying to do here, especially with, um, sorry, I got distracted for a second. Um, but yeah, that's what I was trying to go for and I thought I'd add in a bit of color, mostly because Jack is a Nephilim, but he's not any Nephilim. He is, um, spoiler. He's the son of Satan, like the actual son of Satan. So I wanted to, he has a trademark. It's even in the opening card for this year's season and even toward the end of last season that he had these glowing yellow eyes. 
and I really wanted to get that through but not just have them be right there on the pupil so I went with kind of a brush effect almost like uh, someone took a watercolor brush dipped it in some ink and said right across the top um so yeah I'm just gonna leave it at that I talked through the whole video there's no reason to pause and come back I talked through the whole damn thing <laughs> so thank you guys for watching if you want to see a full version of this picture you or a special version that I'm not showing here it was Instagram exclusive only uh, you can head to my Instagram down in the description box below um, and if you want to see this drawing and all this magnificent glory you could check out my portfolio site down below or my art tumblr which I am trying to get up and going and try to get back in the habit of posting stuff on there so thank you guys for watching if you like what you saw and you want to see more um then hit the thumbs up button and hit subscribe really appreciate it and if you didn't you can hit thumbs down it's okay you won't hurt my feelings um check me out other social media sites down in the description below and um yeah i guess in the comments section let me know what you thought about this piece Oh, do you watch Supernatural? How do you feel about this upcoming season? It's almost over with. We only get 20 episodes this time. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.